Hello, how are you today? Today, we are going to look at numbers and find different ways we can show that number. Here, I'll show you. Look at this number symbol. What does this symbol mean? Think it to yourself. Say it. Five. That symbol means five. I can count five in a lot of different ways. If I look at my hand, I have five fingers. Count five of your fingers. One, two, three, four, five. What if I show you this dice? You might use a dice when you play games. How many dots are showing on this dice? You might recognize how many that dice shows. If not, count it and say it out loud. One, two, three, four, five. This time, I showed five on dice. Another way that mathematicians can show five is using a tool called a ten frame. A mathematician is a fancy way to say someone who studies math. Look at this ten frame. How many dots does this ten frame show? One, two, three, four, five. It shows five. We found another way that we can show five. How about tallies? Count with me as I draw five tallies. You make tally lines by drawing short lines. One, two, three, four, and then the fifth one goes across it like a seat belt. This picture shows five tallies. Wow, there are so many ways I can make five. No matter how I draw it, this symbol always shows five. Five toes on my foot, five books on a shelf, five apples on the table. Can you think of any other ways? We've looked a lot at the number five, but did you know that you can do this with every other number? Number symbols have the same quantity, no matter how you draw them. Let's take a look. I have four different ways to show this number. Can you tell what number I'm drawing? Tallies. Ten frame. Dice. Numeral. Three. All these pictures are different ways to show three. One more example. What number am I showing you? Tallies. Ten frame. Dice. Numeral. Eight. Here are four different ways to show the number eight. These all have a quantity of eight. Quantity is a fancy way to say how many we have. 